Joe, you're down in Texas along with Simone. Joe, uh, the terrible news out of Texas was two McCown, Texas uh, police officers were responding to a domestic call. They knocked on the door, the door opened, and the guy shot both these guys dead. They were simply responding to a call. They did not see it coming. You're there in Texas along with them. This has got to strike close to home. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is just infuriating and it's heartbreaking. These officers were just doing their job, responding to a domestic violence call, and this monster ambushes them and kills them. And to make matters worse, when one of these officers' daughter to put a touching tribute on Twitter to her father, you had all these keyboard warrior losers who live in mom's basement completely trolled her and said some of the most vile things imaginable to her. But that's where we are in 2020. The constant drumbeat from some politicians and some in the media of the anti-police rhetoric and the false narratives have just caused all of these attacks on law enforcement. But, but don't take my word for it. Just look at the numbers. We've had over 159 police officers shot in this country this year. That's yeah. 20. That's one every 29 hours, which is actually an increase over last year's historic numbers. Since the George Floyd incident 48 days ago, we've had 54 police officers shot, mm. and it is showing no signs of slowing down. Just the other day in Detroit, you had local media jump all over a story and put out a false narrative that this suspect wasn't trying to kill police officers, and meanwhile, the video showed he tried to murder two police officers at gunpoint. Everyone needs to slow down. Let's get the right information out there, and let's remind politicians, the media, and the public that 99% of us are out there doing a great job putting our lives on the line, it's okay to still support us while holding the other 1% right. to give us a bad name accountable. These things aren't mutually exclusive. And Simone, I know you're down in Dallas, uh, Texas, as